What's up, Zulu gang? And we're back here for another fucking video, man. Shout out to the Zulu gang and shout out to the whole gang, man. Make sure you guys comment. I need everybody to comment Zulu gang. If you're part of the Zulu gang, I want every comment in this fucking video to be Zulu gang. Let's go. But shout out to the Zulu gang. But today, we're here to talk about the brand Papa Herbs. Shout out to Papa Herbs, man. They finally responded, guys. And this is the question I feel like everybody has been wondering. Will Shaka Zulu still be smoking Papa Herbs? Okay, first they hit us with this response first, guys. I'm gonna show you guys the response. I put it on my story, and I think I talked a little bit about it in the comment below. And then there's also a short that I made that hit like, I think 1.1K that shows what they respond. So they said, hey fam, we did hear about it. We are coming out with Papa Herbs response for, for them so we can set the record clear. For the Reddit Familia, shout out to the Reddit fam. If you're part of the Reddit fam, let me know in the comments too. The two ingredients mentioned in the post are not in our Papa's Herb cartridge in Cali, Florida, or Canada market. The package in that picture was a time production run from a year ago in only Oregon with a terpene provider approved to us by the state of Oregon and approved by the Department of Health in Oregon. We did one production run with them ever in Oregon one year ago. We never did another production one with them again in Oregon or any other market. We're gonna come out with a response for the fan to make this clear. So shout out to Papa Urs, man. Thank you for getting back to me. And I just wanna start off by saying like, I've never said that I was, you know, right. At the end of my video, make sure you guys watch the video that I post, a full video. I said I was waiting for a response from Papa Herbs. Um, they haven't responded yet, and I've just been waiting for a response so I could give to you guys, and so I can actually know myself, so I can have more knowledge and stuff like that. I've been getting a lot of messages and comments from people too, though, you know, and then also um, from Papa Herbs, finally, they actually sent me, um, you know, uh, a document that basically tells you guys what's going on and like, you know, why it's not harmful and stuff like that. So I just want you guys to know that none of that stuff is in the products that are in California or anywhere, even in Oregon, I guess now, they're not in Oregon or anything. It was during that one production run and they use a different, they use a provider back then. And you know, sometimes you switch providers after a while once you figure out what's going on, really going on. So they got a different provider, you know what I'm saying? But this is what they sent to me, guys. I'm gonna screen record it right now um so let's see what it says statement regarding papa herbs run in oregon thank you papa's familia uh for bringing this to our attention and our post regarding ingredients that are used by our licensed partner in oregon we take any claims regarding safety and quality of our papa herbs products very seriously i love that man i love that papa herbs takes that shit seriously shout out to papa herbs because i took it seriously too and i'm not like, you know, when I'm wrong, I'm I'm the type of person that will admit when I'm wrong. And right now, I'm glad that we got this response and I'm glad we got it cleared up. I just wanna make sure that I'm also smoking good stuff. And the reason why I made that vlog also, guys, just so you guys know a little bit of insight, you know, I sent them that, sh I sent them that stuff and they weren't responding for like days. So I ended up just saying, fuck it, I'm gonna make the video um, real quick. It, it wasn't like super amount of days. It was like a day. I waited like a day or something, but they like, you know, they were just taking a little bit of while and people kept messaging me and telling me about this. So I decided, um, because that's what, that's, that's what one, like, since I promote Papa Herbs, a lot of people that, you know, if something goes wrong with Papa Herbs, I'm going to get hit up. And I got a lot of messages about this, um, from people um in my dms and from reddit talked to me about it and stuff so i was like damn I, I have to at least talk about it bring it up um i hit them up first to see if they respond they didn't respond for a while so i said fuck it i'm just gonna make the video put it out there when i made the video we we finally got a response but shout out to papa herbs all love never hate man i love the brand they have done so much for me providing me with product and stuff to review for you guys you know, they're they're literally fam. He like Papa Herbs has literally brought my merch. You know what I'm saying? So I got a lot of love for Papa Herbs. So that's why I was a little bit disappointed 
when I heard about it. I, I was disappointed for a second. I thought they were ignoring me because I did send them. I thought they were ignoring me basically because I did send it to them and they saw it and they didn't respond for a day. So they saw what I said and they didn't re respond for like a day. So that's why I thought that, you know, I thought I was being screwed over or something. But I'm glad me and me and Papa Earth, we had a conversation, we talked about it. And, you know, it's just something that's naturally in, um, something that just naturally shows up um, in weed, guys. So let me find where I was on the, on this freaking thing because I'm looking through it, reading through it all. Okay. Papa Herb customers at the forefront of everything we do. At Papa Herb's facts and sci sci scientific information. Sorry, guys. At Papa Herb's facts and sci scientific information are basis of how we ensure our product, our product, how we ensure our product and integrity. Sorry, I'm just messing up reading, guys, because it's kind of small, so I have to zoom in a little bit. Um, product safety and a best in class experience for our customers or for the consumers. The referred Reddit post was inaccurate and reached conclusions that facts and science do not support. We stand behind our product and our ingredient and formulations. Below is an overview of the ingredients inaccurately referred in the post and clarification of each ingredient supporting the science. The compound but but butric acid, AKA botonic acid are naturally found in all cannabis products. The referred study shows um, it has about 86% of botanic uh, or butanic acid in it of the medical cannabis sample test that these samples were found to be a level six times higher in cannabis than in our Papa Papa's products. So this stuff actually comes up six times higher and you know, some norm like other products, you know what I'm saying? Like an actual cannabis, probably actual weed. I'm thinking they're, they're talking about, um, then in their product. So as you guys can see, I'll try and zoom in on it. Uh, I'll try and zoom on it and put a screenshot on on the um, on the screen so you guys can see. And just to let you guys know that you know, like I said, they're they're using a different provider now, anyways. So you know this stuff does, is gonna be honestly in your weed and your cards and your concentrate or whatever but it's low amount guys low amounts so i just want to do you know i want to apologize myself i want to apologize to papa herbs and then i also want to apologize to you guys as consumers and you guys that watch me just my fans the zulu gang everybody out there and this is from the bottom of my heart because i don't like lying or talking about stuff that's not true um, like the Reddit post did say it had butric acid. So it w they were right that there was butric acid in the actual product, but they were wrong in, in the fact that the percentage is low. It's not something that's going to harm you necessarily. And then we also got to remember guys that weed is going to harm you period guys. Weed is going to harm you period. You're smoking, uh, you're smoking. Smoking is just bad for you period. So you also got to remember that too, guys. But man, shout out to Papa Earth for just hitting me up and just talking to me and just showing mad love. Um, and this is just me setting the record straight and also Papa Herb setting the record straight. So at the end, it says concentration levels. Let's see, the study listed for ethanol sentiment includes a sample size that is equivalent to over 50,000% more than what is normally found in the average Papa Herb product distributed in Oregon. Ethanol sentiment is found at 50 ppm parts per million. This is extremely small components of our products at a 0.00143%, ultimately rendering an inaccurate comparison of the fact. Safety testing and certificates are terpenes are third party safety tested by SC labs for solvents, pesticides, heavy metals, um, they post their results and you can see the attachment. I'm going to try and, um, 
get this Google Doc. It's under, you know, Papa Herbs Google Doc. So I don't know if I could hit the link. It's not letting me hit the link on it right here from just open it. But if you guys have any questions, you guys can always hit up Papa Herbs in their DMs um, on their Instagram. I'll put their Instagram on the thing and I'll put their email on there so you guys could always hit them up. So, you know what I'm saying, guys? Don't be scared to try Papa Herbs. Don't be scared to try their product. Um, it's not bad. You know what I'm saying? The stuff is naturally what's in cannabis and stuff like that. And that's something I had to learn. I didn't even know that. And I've never, and I just want to put this out there too that I never claimed to be this all knowing person of cannabis. I've always told you guys think for yourself, do your own research don't follow everybody man like i i know you guys want to call us influencers but i am just you know i'm a vlogger when i when people call me influencer i hate it like it kind of like it kind of gives me a i don't know it kind of feels off like it found it sounds just weird because i'm just a vlogger man i'm just vlogging my life my everyday life but also giving you guys information about things. And sometimes I'm off about that. And if, and if I am, I am gonna admit that I'm wrong. If you, if you give me good information, I'm gonna say, okay, man, this actually sounds right. You know what I'm saying? So again, you guys, I apologize to some of you guys. Um, you know, I apologize, you know what I'm saying? Forgive you if I scared you. Um, and for just giving you kind of some some wrong information, you know what I'm saying? But, you know, so going forward, I will be smoking Papa Herbs, you know what I'm saying? I honestly gave away my Papa Herbs. I gave away two grams that I spent hell like money on. Like, because I, well, I had to buy three. So I gave away three grams because I smoked a little bit. So I gave like three and a half grams away of Papa Herbs pretty much and that's like 80 something dollars so i'm not the only one taking a loss on this one um i apologize guys you know i'm definitely gonna you guys are definitely probably gonna see a review with a papa herb soon next time i can purchase some more papa herbs for you guys because three new strains did come out shout out to papa herbs always showing love um but this is the information guys these are the facts this is scientifically proven the facts are right there you can hit up papa herbs um, so it's up to you guys to decide whether you guys want to try and smoking it still or not. Me personally, I probably will still be smoking it. But honestly, you guys, moving forward, too, I will be trying to smoke more concentrate and trying to smoke more weed. So I might be buying more Papa Herbs concentrate, Papa Herbs weed, just because, you know, just going forward, I'm just, uh, I don't know. I just want to, you know, switch it up. I feel like... A lot of people want to see me smoke weed and smoke concentrate and I feel like I have been doing carts for a lot for a long time on the channel um, but I still am gonna be standing behind Papa's herb I'm still supporting still all that good shit man shout out to Papa herbs for showing love and actually responding actually being willing to call me and actually talk to me you know what I'm saying not many companies are willing to do something like that so shout out to the fucking Zulu gang. Remember to like, comment, subscribe. Remember to eat, breathe, smoke weed. And we're going fucking live streaming after this video. Fuck it. Let's get it. You can zoom in, whatever. That's where I'm going. be me you don't like what you see so you rub up on my energy i just want to be me smoking on the end of week so i just close my eyes because i know that one day everything everything's gonna be all right 
If I try, I know I fly Open your eyes and see past my flesh And see in my mind I open my heart, you see all my scars You see all the love that I push in the dark Always feel alone so I hop in my car Push button start I dream every day as I look to the stars Spilling my heart while I'm spitting these bars All alone and all alone On my own Get it to go. <laughs> Jump on the smoothest one. Smoothest. Ooh.